This is exactly how I busted my knee, by the way. I put skates on, skated out the door, and pulled something. So it's, I've always been hesitant to skate to the spot now. I usually walk. What do you think? I'm gonna fucking zoom. Oh, they feel very wobbly. The, the cuff feels very low. So. Yeah, they, they're quick to put on. So what's gonna happen? It's gonna go to clips for a few minutes. Don't, you need to tell me. The second you can see me, spam the chat, okay? I need to know you're there. I'll take you around, we'll see what's going on. Hopefully nothing goes wrong. That's the plan, all right? D you can't leave me behind here, guys. This is gonna be horrible without you. I need you guys to support. I can't see the chat. <laughs> if I do this, it's so windy, man. And uh, yeah, I don't know if I, <laughs> I look like someone was at the park. I'm not gonna lie. These skates were fucking sick though, they feel real good. Can you hear me? It's so windy, dude. <laughs> There's no way you can hear me. It's full of shit. I can't be fucking it out. Let's, let's do the, the half five, it's safer, okay? Half five. That kind of hurt too, I'm not gonna lie, it hurt my knee a bit. It's like that, my buckles are done. At least it feels like it. It's like it. It's windy as it is in Cali, it's always this windy here. Best part though, you see like over there, it's like, limestone or whatever, like sand, blows in your eyes, great. This flying eagle frame design is so sick, it really is, right? It's an eagle, it can be a tri setup too. These skates feel good though, man, they feel fast and nimble, and they feel really nice, like, I do think I should have probably warmed up a bit though, this, the bowl definitely fucked my knee a bit there. It's just so much easier to like air out and stuff on big wheels, like so much easier. It does feel more dangerous though, because you kind of, you tip more, because you're not used to the extra oomph when you uh, air out. They fit like it's perfect. They feel super comfortable at this stage anyway. My toes feel like they have enough room. Not too much though. There's a little aching here, like a foot ache. I was probably just getting used to it. They're not, nothing too bad. They've got a good look down, right? They look, they feel sleek and fast. They're cool. Let's see if I can just boost around the park, eh? And you can tell me which view is better, okay? This is gonna help. That's so quick. I just smoke beer to take care of the pain. I'll, I'll write that one down again. Okay? It's very distracting. <laughs> I can see me, it looks stupid. <laughs> what was better? Looking back or looking forward? Let's do uh, any any trick requests. I haven't done a 540 in a long time. I think it might hurt. But we'll do one for you. Keep on blading. Let me try the angle you said too. Mm, that won't be right there. It would be more like that. But front foot selfie? No, that won't work. Be like this. How sickening is that? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that's gonna work. 540 out of here, I think. Even though it's pretty hard to five out of that. Alright, can I land this? Being, I haven't done a 540 in like eight months. So I should be able to do it though. <laughs> Feels very uncomfortable. I blame the skates. <laughs> no 360 warm up. That probably would have been smart. Not gonna lie, Parker. You'll go straight to 540. Yeah, it's the warm up, dude. You don't need a 360. <laughs> oh wait, were you upside down? <laughs> My bad. Yeah, I mean, I am close to Australia, so it's probably right. You can do it like a first person 360. 
sure that'll go well. <laughs> Did you see it? <laughs> I swear I'm doing it. All right, let me show you some sides. There's some cool shit on right now. Never let me do this shit again, okay? Okay, so yeah, that's the Wellington Typo sign. The idea is that you stand in it as the eye. You're the eye in Wellington. Super cute. Kind of weird. <laughs> it's super fucking windy though, so. How's the connection? It's gotta be going between different south towers at this point, all right? Maybe not. This is definitely harder to do though in the skate park, I'd say. It feels a lot more, like it's harder to take breaks. It's harder to, because it's so windy, I feel like I can't talk. Uh, <laughs> and the, the, the most important part of the stream is talking to you guys, but uh, what do you think? Good views? Sometimes I do urban skating through town and the wind really makes your legs work out. Yeah, if you go if you go one way and come back, this one I like about here is like, it's the closest experience to like a, a electric skates. To have a wind like this behind you, you can go so fast, dude, so good. Of course, when you're going the other way, it fucking sucks. It sucks so much. <laughs> I've almost gone through half my battery at this point. I have a bunch of notifications, which makes me worried. That's why I always wanna, the phone I was using someone else, I'm using just a Galaxy, Samsung Galaxy S10e, it's old as fuck, and it's good though. Ideally, I'd get a new phone, and this would be the stream phone, and then I wouldn't have the problems of not being able to see my notifications, and not be able to see chat, and still having a good camera, you know? How's the angle though? Is that shit? It feels less cringe than doing the selfie cam while skating. That feels way worse, I'm not gonna lie. I feel straight up touristy as shit. There are a lot of tourists here right now, that's it. I can blend in, right? I think the ideal would be uh, like an Insta360 view where, because the, the fucking, just looking back like this, you only see me. And then the looking the other way, it's not really a first person, it's like too cropped in, so they both suck in their own way. There's a bridge up this way that's kind of hard to cross, especially if it's busy, so I usually go the other way. But the wrong problem with that is it's narrower, so if anyone's coming, I can't go that way. So we're just gonna, we'll wait and see, okay? With the first person view again. It's a beautiful day of wind. I'm gonna have to fly through some people up here, which is not good, but it should be all right. Oh. This will be testing the connection. steer all these steps without having a without trying without being scared I, I have done it it always scares me this is my like urban training grounds if it's quiet it's not dirt <laughs> uh, it's a nice little platform with some like steps very mellow steps to steer all Yeah, it's part of the character. Yeah, the rail on the water, I have skated that. I'll show you. Now, if you don't care about falling in the water, that's a fucking beast rail, dude. You can come, the ground's super rough as well. <laughs> but I have skated, I skated it from about like 
like halfway into the front nook in the top cell and then get to the footpath here. I don't know if I could do that again. It's cool though. Okay, we're gonna risk it all and try to steer all these steps for you in first person. The bigger ones. <laughs> I think I got it though. This case is sturdy. I'll try. We'll do a forward steer roll down these, okay? Very easy, very mellow. But it can definitely go wrong. It doesn't even look like stairs to you, but I'll try. Okay. Should be fine. <laughs> that had all the opportunities to go wrong, I'll tell you. Oh shit, who was that? Three years sandal, god damn. Here's another dream spot, you're gonna love this one. Absolute dream to hit this man, if I was... Got good enough one day. <laughs> Look at that thing, dude. That's a hammer. Yeah, I don't know, the fakey sterols don't feel as safe to me right now. All right, I'll have a drink and we'll hit the next, we'll hit the next spot. But um, what do you think? What's, how's this format work? Is it possible to string big wheel? Is it interesting? It does add more stress to me, I'll be real. It's, uh, it's making me not think about my knee as much and I feel like I'm putting more strain on it. These are the Flying Eagle X8s or something. Lino sent them to me. First session on them, they've got a slight rocker, they're like a stuffed out black, I love them. They feel really good. The fact that I'm confident enough to, while holding a camera, do a steer roll, it's a good sign that they're good. <laughs> Alright, let's go embarrass myself and try to skate to the next spot, okay? Oh shit, that's a bad idea. <laughs> I didn't do it, oh god, we're going too fast. There's a little wooden part up here. It looks like it's a dream skate spot, but it somehow isn't. I should get a gimbal. <laughs> I think you hit by a car. Tell me it's not designed to skate. Look at this shit. Problem is right. The wood is all just spaced far enough for your wheels to be stuck. It's pretty genius capping, if you ask me. It's like just big enough for you to get stuck. Makes it very sketchy to skate. So this is a flat heel boot. Good question, psychotic. It's a flat heel boot with the shock absorber in it, like a. Uh, and you can see it. I'll show you. I think it's flat heel, but this little rub of it. It's actually the shock is all bit, like hooks into the side of like that. It feels really good. Very, very impressed. I recommend everyone get a big wheel pair of skates. The, the aggressive skates are way, just way worse for skating around. I have used two gigs of data, 2.4 gigs of data, which is a little high for how long we've been live. <laughs> but uh, I remember I got it down a lot by dropping the 720p. I I don't know if we can drop further than that, you know. Look at this spot though, man. It looks like a dream come true spot, but then you come here and you can't fucking skate it. It sucks, man. I remember when they were building it, I was like, bro, oh, it's gonna be so sick. Bro. It's funny, I'm definitely super spoiled to have such a good place to roll so close to home. Don't even have to drive anywhere down to catch any public transport. I can just walk out the door and I have like this kind of kind of free long strip of place to skate. I definitely take it for granted, for sure. That's why I think this is a good idea to give me streaming because it'll get me out there doing it more. But uh, it's like not enough of a challenge, you know, like it's too safe. It's like, because it's so safe to skate, it's, there's no challenge, you know, versus like, if I know the like uh, the stuttering skater or even, there was someone on the Discord maybe, talked about how they skate through New York. And it's like, oh, that won't get old because you, you're almost going to die every time you're skating, you know, <laughs> darting through traffic and shit. And I don't want to do that, but uh, it would add a lot of, Fine. <laughs> a lot of uh, it makes it more like aggressive skating because there's more to do. Anyway, I'll show you. We'll do a quick tour. Oh, I think it's so much more speed. <laughs> the fucking wind is so good. How do I not get hit by this truck? Inside or outside? <laughs> Sorry. Nah. <laughs> I'm 
See if I could just come here and fucking hit this. Which I definitely could do. I love my 3x1 tin setup. I got the GC alloy frames for fun to ride. I can't, I don't like tri I'd say I found them too tall. And you can't, I can't steer all of them. But that's me. It feels a lot more like you're not in control doing steer rolls on tri skates. Keep on blading. I do got this right. 4x72, I think, with an H plug. No, no. I think 4x90 is probably my favorite big wheel, which is what I got right now. Yeah, I wish I could do that, but without uh, hesitating. You know, I hesitate, I can't just roll up and do it. I wish I could just roll up and do it. It's all a confidence thing. All right, this way back is usually, there's so much backwind usually, that you can get some mega speed, dude. So, let's try it out. Very fast. Sick rail, it's a square rail though. Dream of hitting that one there. Oh. Here's another spot, a ledge that I've skated. No, he didn't have shit, this is boring. Dude. I'll try to fall over more. I appreciate it, guys. We hit to the beach and we'll see what's going on. So, yeah, the last few. You now, I think of, you know, there's the uh, streamer Sea Dog. He does like a. He like rides a bike around like the world on stream. That's fucking sick dude. <laughs> we could do that on skates. Uh, but yes, that's a good cause I got. That's my, a dumb take from me. I've got if you're bringing skates to the country, yeah definitely just bring a frame. But and that's a good call for winter clash too for sure because <laughs> you want to have a like an aggressive setup, you know, for that. But even yeah like a like a not like a what do you call it? A compass frame or something would help a lot too. But ultimately, for big wheel stuff, a dedicated skate for it is significantly better. Doesn't matter what frame you get. Yeah, look at these bikes. Isn't this cool? It's a little dock. It's very nice. You might even see a stingray if the day is good enough. Before I get kicked out of here, though. Nice little tour of Wellington from your Twitch computer. Oh, can I steer all this? <laughs> nope. What camera's better, by the way? Is the zoomed in one? Because I noticed I, like, the perspective's a little bad from the zoom out one. I don't know. Let's try the zoom in one for a bit. Definitely very prone to dropping everything right now. It's not a good handle I have on these. With the big fucking, got this big thing in my hand. public spot to talk to you guys though, but I'll be real. We'll try. How how was that zoomed in look? Was it alright? How do you mark you with it out of self? You could do it. <laughs> yes, let me. Oh no, so you're in the same boat as me, Cyber. So, yeah, I agree. Every time I set up a big wheel aggressive skate, I don't ever use the big wheel setup again. I'm too lazy to change it. If I have to change frames to go big wheel, I'm just not going big wheel. That's how I work. Both were good, okay. I'm surprised, I figured the wide angle would be better because, you know, like a GoPro. You can see better. I guess you can't see me, so it probably doesn't matter. The uh, eight people who stayed sub for my big hiatus there, I appreciate it a lot. It means a lot. It's such a good backwind right now that it's gonna suck to come back. <laughs> Go down the hill. See, that's what I think is missing from my skate session, just a hill bomb. Very splashy. Oh, getting sprayed. 
There's no safe hill to go down, man. There's too much traffic. I've given, that's probably the good tour of Wellington. That's the waterfront I get to skate every day, and that's good. You should be jealous, okay? Just saying. <laughs> this bit is a bit rough, but the rest of it is smoother than this, which is crazy. This isn't too rough either, it's good. Uh, I like, like these skates a lot. They are good. Uh, like they feel like a big improvement off the, off the mesmers, of the micro, sorry. It feels like a big step up. Even with the endless frames though, they feel better. They feel better than the endless frames. Um, I could all consider doing this every week, maybe, depending on how my knee is. Probably more aggressive than touring the scene like this, because it's much more cringe to do. It's much harder to do as well. Look at the big cruise ship over there. There's two of them there. That's fucking huge. It's like a 20 story building. Uh, anyway, nah, I should probably call it here anyway. I should probably call it. Should we do more of this? Is it cool? Is it better than sitting in my desk? You guys rule. Really, I appreciate you guys still being here after I've fucking gone live in like two months. <laughs> it means a lot. Oh, yeah, I'll see you guys, uh, I'll see you guys later.